I created this rubric for national boards because they require a rubric to go with everything that you do, which is not a bad thing, but I feel like I'm not an art teacher and therefore I have no place in scoring kids' sketches. So right here when it talks about the, the relevance of the sketch, I think that's pretty, I think I actually could score a kid on it. Is the sketch relevant to the story? Now, the problem is, is that I haven't read all the kids' stories. Um, kids are reading books that I have not read, so I don't really know if that's going to be pertinent or not. Um, having a conference with a kid, I could determine that, or looking at their sketch to stretch and kind of talking with them about their book, then I could definitely figure that out. But, um, but unless I talk to every kid, I'm not going to be able to score them on that. The second part is an act accurate visualization of the scene. So I have no idea if a kid is what the kid is visualizing, what the kid is not visualizing. So I think that, you know, for the most part, we all are about visualizing the same thing. If a writer is writing something, they create that visualization for us. But um, again, I don't feel confident scoring kids on that. Now, one thing I do, I am kind of picky about is if a kid just kind of draws a tiny little stick figure in one corner, I don't feel like that is is giving the best sketch to stretch. I don't feel like they're showing me what's going on in their brains. They may not be the best artist, but they do need to either create a series of pictures or one giant scene. Um, and that's completely up to them and I'll, I'll allow them to do either one. But again, I don't tend to use a rubric much. Um, I have used it in the past, but I don't feel like I am qualified enough to score them on their drawings.